So this is what I'm going to do. Hold on. on. Laid into her horn at me. Oh shoot, somebody playing Ryder Rich. I'ma get lazy. What is good you guys? This is Jay. Currently walking downtown. First time I ever met somebody that just knew me from you know what I do that like asked about me. I forgot how much my downtown city has grown. Like it's still pretty swole out here, and it's like a Thursday night. I keep forgetting that there are some people who haven't gone back to work yet because of everything going on. But yeah, it's a decent size. I saw, I even saw like a line of people at the dance club up there, but I don't think I'm gonna be heading there tonight. One day I'm gonna, be, I'm gonna need one of those bands when I'm on tour. Don't copyright me. Okay, y'all, I can see her over there. So this is what I'm going to do. Hold on. I'm going to yeah, I see you. Well, they were pretty chill. It's always cool to make new friends. There's a small part of me that feels like I should have brought Lucille with me. That's my bat. Whew. Thought I was heading the wrong direction, but I think I'm in the right direction. As soon as I get back to the house, guess what I'm doing? Sleep! I don't even feel sleepy. I feel like I could just go to the airport and fly somewhere. But I gotta get up super early in the morning. So, whew. note to those in Greenville jaywalking is not illegal. Yeah, when random people start to cat call you, it's time to go. Correction when random drunk people try to cat call you, it's time to go. Excuse me, sir. That's not safe. Someone might steal your gas. Before I go to bed, I need some aloe drink, if you guys know what I'm talking about. I know for a fact the QT I passed had it. I'm not sure if Spinks has it. With pulp, just like I like it. You guys, I would've got all this on camera earlier, but it was way too dark and my camera's not that good in the dark. These people were sitting at this red light, right? I was behind them. I went around them, sat there for a solid three minutes. The light did not change. They looked at me, I looked at them, they looked at me, I looked at them. I inched up a little bit, they inched up a little bit. There were two cars coming to my right. I waited for these two cars to pass and I continued through the red light. And the funny thing was, they followed right behind me. <laughs> the guy that just went in behind me looked just like Peter Parker. Two things about this one girl that just laid into her horn at me. Now that I'm safe behind closed doors, as I was saying two things, pointed out about this one girl that just laid into her horn at me. Number one, all you have to do is honk one time. Why do you have to lay into it? Number two, this part kind of pissed me off. You stick your head out at me and sit there when you could have kept driving but instead you decide to stare at me and throw your hands up like this for a solid 45 seconds. 
you ain't gonna do nothing, I suggest you keep driving. I was getting real, oh man, I was getting so mad. The next day. You guys, so I ran over this thing and I used to be afraid to hit these because I see them all the time around downtown, but check this out. They bend. Who knew? I don't know, I just thought this was neat. If I have like a, a separate room in my future house, I might get something like this. It's like a saloon thing. <laughs> I never heard of a place having a strict dress code against wearing shorts. You have to have like long jeans to get in. That's my, that's a first. Yeah, I saw that Hummer. I saw this, um, what is Jeep? Jeep Rubicon? That's one of the cars I'm gonna get one day. Side note, I know it looks like it's the same night, but this is actually a different day. I just came back downtown because I was bored. I didn't want to go to bed. Well, y'all, the only thing that's popping, that's really going on tonight, is restricted to me because I don't have on jeans. So, the only logical thing to do now is go home. I will keep you updated if anything exciting or somewhat entertaining happens. Oh, I know you guys, I know. But I couldn't help myself. I had to do it one last time. There we go. That Suburban is nice, I like it. I feel like my car collection is gonna be really sick because there's so many cars that I want. So one day I'm probably gonna have to just have a whole separate like jumbo garage thing for like, at least like three to six cars. I don't know, it would, I've never been one. <clears throat> I've never been one to buy things just to impress other people. I'm more of a guy that likes to, um, buy things because I genuinely want that thing that I decided to buy. I don't think about how long it's gonna have value. I don't think about that stuff. You know, when it comes to stuff like clothes, a car, what, whatever, even if, even when I get my Rolex one day, you know, uh, cause one of the goals just to signify how much work I've done one day is to buy cash pay for a Rolex one day you know I want to be able to look at it and be like yo this resembles you know all the years I've been you know grinding but um yeah I get stuff for me usually or if I get stuff and it's not for me um it's specifically targeted as a toward a certain person for a get as a gift so um yeah, I don't do stuff for people's approval. In my personal opinion, that's stupid. I'm not gonna lie, I might have to get a pack of this stuff right here. This aloe vine, this aloe vine drink right here. I done got addicted to it. That pulp in there is so freaking good. I swear I drink these almost every other day. Just getting home. Oh my gosh, I'm sleeping. I wanna, since I got so much stuff going on tomorrow, I wanna start fresh and I, I'm already so far into this video, so I think I'm just gonna go ahead and wrap this up with a couple fun facts, maybe three. When it comes to food, I love everything. There's only two things I can't eat, mashed potatoes and beans because texture makes my gag reflexes jump. My brother and my sister are the same way, but they're, they're like that with bananas. They can't eat bananas. I love bananas. Fun fact two. I don't know if you guys can tell from some of my videos, but I'm highly extroverted. Not every day, but some days I'm a social butterfly. I can talk to anyone. I was, I was literally talking to a lot of people while I was walking downtown today. And I can travel anywhere and make a friend within the same day I get there. If you didn't already notice. And fun fact number three, I've gotten a lot better about it, but, and most people that meet me wouldn't know, 
But a lot of times I struggle with loneliness and depression too. I wouldn't call it depression anymore. It was a little bit more intense a few years back. I guess I can just say I feel a little bit sad some days. Mainly because I overthink stuff sometimes. Especially when you live by yourself, you get a lot of reflecting time, a lot of thinking time. Just listen to this, listen to this. You hear that? Nothing. Nothing but your thoughts. Like imagine having like nothing to do for an entire day. Absolutely nothing. Nobody to hang with, nowhere to go, nothing to do. Groceries filled up, all your errands are done. You're just sitting in here for a couple hours, just you and your thoughts. What do you think about? But, I'm gonna leave that there. Appreciate y'all for watching. Hopefully y'all like, comment, and subscribe. I don't know how long this video lasted for, but I hope it's someone entertained you. I might put this up with another video just because I don't think it's gonna be that long. Two videos in one day. I want to post three videos a day, but there's so much stuff going on that there's not enough time in the day to do that. But I will get to that point eventually. Appreciate you guys again. I'll holla at you. Peace. <laughs>